he became king. Under his rule, the beastmen banded together and created the kingdom of Ferolia. There he and his kin waited for a chance to get revenge on the humans who drove them into hiding. <laughs> well, 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 it isn't his furry majesty himself. How do you do this fine, fine night? <laughs> ah, finally! The time is upon us, sire. With the coming shift in the world's mana power, now's the perfect opportunity for what? For us! All to get back at those nasty humans! <laughs> Do I know you? Oh, how silly of me! They call me Gormand, Death Devourer. Our goals are the same, for I hate humankind as much as you do. May I offer you some unsolicited help? Tch. Outsiders and help are unwelcome. Be gone! <laughs> uh, uh, no, 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 wait, wait, wait. I'll leave, but if you change your mind, my dark spell are always at your service. <laughs> Wait. I'll give you one chance. Oh, I shan't waste it. Now then, tell me what you would have me do, and consider it done. Your majesty. <laughs> Kevin was the one and only son of Ferolia's king. The young boy's human mother had long since abandoned her half-blood child, leaving him to be raised in the forest by the Beastmen. Due to his Spartan upbringing, Kevin never connected with others. He was raised as his father's successor and trained to fight from infancy, leaving little time for friendships. One night, the young prince came across a slain mother wolf and her living pup, Carl. Finding a true friend in the affectionate wolf, the boy's frozen heart began to thaw. Hey, sleep good? Huh? Carl? What's that yip, Carl? Tiny, but still a wolf. Don't bark like a dog. Here, howl. Like this. Uh, we're alike. You and me. A little wolf who acts like a dog. A beast man with human blood in my veins. And Neither of us have a mom. Don't worry. Carl, got you. And I'll protect you, since your mom can't now. Carl, what's wrong? No, Carl, can't fight you, won't fight you.
moving on its own. How did this happen? Unable to resist his beastman instincts, the boy transformed and attacked his only friend. Kevin made a grave by the flower patch they'd often visited. Racked with guilt, there he wept for his lost friend. So... So sorry, Carl. I'm sorry. <laughs>